Alright guys, I'm going to be doing a review of the <coughs> Nike Tempo Legend 4's Film Ground Black and White Clash Colorway made for Euros this year, last year, sorry 2012. Alright, I'm going to start with what I don't like about the boot and what is good about the boot. This is bearing in mind I've had the boots only six months and this and I've had other boots for about a year, year and a half and this hasn't happened. So to begin with as you can see the work is peeling away from the upper, you can see kangaroo leather underneath it. I think it is kangaroo leather that they use on this one. Yeah the kangaroo leather. See, on the right foot as well, predominantly where I kick here, you can see, um, discoloration of the laces is expected considering they're white, but no matter how much you wash them, clean them, it never comes out Um The heel line is constantly wet, that leaks into the boot, let's see, I'll try and squeeze. So it's wet, boot takes a long period of time to dry. I wore these on Thursday, and if you look, they're still wet. Been out the bag and everything, last two days. Um, the sole plates peeling away already after six months of use. Um, I don't know if you can see here, but the hill counter is a little bit, it's dropped out a bit here, and it's yeah, quite painful. Um, what else is there? The liner here, that's ripped off. Come away from the, that's inside the boot here, you can see. This happened on this one as well, I think. As long as he stays there, his wound will never advance. He can literally cheat death forever. That's why I picked the dragonfly. Yeah, like that. It has the power to track him in bulk. Um, and the bone boot, the little rubbery hood, comfortable boot. These are wearing away. The so these are wearing down here. Let's see what's on here. Just to show you. Yeah, that one's really flat. Better to this flat. Let's set up and that one. Let's see if it's a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. It's flat. This one isn't, this one isn't, this one isn't. Right. So, let's get down to the actual. What's good about the boot? What's good about the boot is the upper is very soft. Molds very quickly. I wore these once for about an hour or two. I'll do to my feet by the next time I'd worn them. The insole. There's cool. inserts here. These are great. Especially the hill one. Cushions very well. Shame there isn't any in the midfoot. I like on T90s, which I was wearing before. Great padding, which I think I'm not. I think they stopped using it now because I haven't got more my CTRs, as you can probably tell. Um, central lacing system, I think, is great because it's a, just an all round boot. You've got a good striking area of four foot, you can lace it and can take a touch outside of your boot. And that's another problem with the boot, sorry. Night tick is peeling away from the upper. And again on here as well. And there's also peeling there. Um, the aglets come off a lot. Everybody I know with the same boot, the aglets come off. And you know, if you can see, the boot is completely soaked through. Completely. 
which I think is disgraceful considering the amount of money it costs. Uh, 80, 90 pound in England, 95, sorry. Uh, I think the stud configuration as well is really good. I like the way it's been changed, it gives you a lot more traction, even running on wet surfaces, a lot more grip. The two longer, four longer back ones, they let you just dig in, turn, these, these ones, you know. And as a defender, you need that quick turn. If the ball comes over the top and you've got a runner, you've got a strike running at you, so you need to be able to turn and get there quickly. Um, bag, typical tempo bag, as you can see. Um, but personally, I think this is a really good boot. I just think that the Clash colorway is just... I think the colourway is terrible, how they produce the colours. As if you can see, where is it? On my left foot. They've literally just put stickers on it, if by the looks of it. Let me try and peel it away. I did when I was at training. it. Literally peel it. If you look and see that. I think that's, I think that's disgusting. Just peeling away from the leather wrapper. No point. No point at all. You might as well just make a more black boot, to be honest. But Nike did what they did. That's, what, that's their problem. They've lost me.